Welcome, Aquarius. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for December 27, 2023, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. Right now, Aquarians are on a building journey, reprogramming themselves to focus on what they really want. An energetic change is perceived, a transformation that requires connecting with internal impulses and having the courage necessary to free oneself from thought patterns based on fear. The key lies in letting go of the need to figure out the how and when of your goals. Rather, there is an emphasis on appreciation and forgiveness to sever energetic ties and allow things to unfold naturally. The suggestion is to disengage from framing and pressure, and instead focus on appreciation and forgiveness. In this reprogramming process, the importance of creating a vision board with affirmations to align the external world with internal desires is highlighted. This involves visualizing and conditioning the external environment to reflect what is sought internally. Furthermore, it is noted that decisions driven by fear and resistance can generate frustration and obstacles to progress towards goals. The call is to pay attention to daily choices and ask questions about whether these choices benefit overall well-being. The angels send a message of abundance, urging Aquarians to release financial worries and allow divine guidance to create and embrace abundance. It is promised that the financial situation will be healed as quickly as permitted. Allow your emotions to play out in whatever way feels natural and liberating, dear Aquarius, as the Taurus moon aligns with revolutionary Uranus. This cosmic climate is ideal for getting important sentiments off your chest, but you should be mindful to play nice when doing so. Tension between Luna and Venus could spell trouble if you go too far expressing delicate sentiments, making it important that you find a balance between honoring your feelings and maintaining composure. Find time to relax at home later in the afternoon when Neptune activates, elevating your senses and need for leisure. Release what does not serve you tonight when the Moon and Pluto connect. Try to form partnerships with people of power and similar interests as well as those who complement your abilities. Few people are trying to influence you by giving false hopes but do not pay heed to what they say. Make your own judgments and adhere by it. You have been planning since long to buy a new house, maybe you can own one this time. If you're stewing over a slight, be careful that you don't spin into a resentment vortex today. With the Sun and Mercury retrograde mashed up in your 12th house of forgiveness, you may struggle to let things go. The irony is, your anger keeps the incident alive for you. And chances are, the other person never even thinks about it. If this was a misunderstanding, take the high road and extend an olive branch. But if this is likely to happen again, and again, cut your losses and begin the healing process now. Mercury, still retrograde, moves back into your friends and dreams sector today, emphasizing your communications with associates, groups, and friends, dear Aquarius. It also is a time for hatching ideas for the future, but watch for missing information or fuzzy thinking. Returning to past issues with a friend is very possible now and for the rest of Mercury's retrograde until January 1st. However, it's also a time for a new way of tackling the same old problem if it keeps cropping up. Resolutions may not come today, but you will be laying the groundwork for the future. Some of the seeds you recently planted concerning long-term goals will likely need review or revision, giving you a second chance to get things just right. Friendships can be a little trickier now, although they'll pick up speed after the first. The moon spends today in your family and home sector, and it's a great time to get in touch with any needs and desires you've kept at bay. In short, the focus for Aquarians right now is to let go of control, trust the process, and make decisions that foster connection with the best version of themselves. Financial healing and the manifestation of desires are intrinsically linked to the willingness to let go, forgive and flow with the natural course of life. Today's tarot reading for your sign. 
Card 1, the Nine of Wands. This card suggests that today you will face challenges that require willpower. You may be in a situation that asks you to persist and try one more time. You may feel like there is still potential to overcome obstacles, but the key is to remain determined. Card 2, the Empress. The presence of the Empress indicates a strong and harmonious connection, possibly in an existing relationship. She may represent the formation of a perfect couple based on shared experiences. However, it can also point out the importance of living in the present and not just basing the relationship on external or material circumstances. Card 3, The Hermit. The Hermit suggests the need to withdraw and reflect on your current situation. It can be beneficial to take some time off to see things from a different perspective. There is a possibility of tensions arising due to stubbornness or resistance to change in a relationship. Card 4, The Tower. The presence of the tower indicates the possibility of unexpected events or drastic changes in your love life. There may be a situation that collapses, revealing the need to face reality. This could relate to the disclosure of problems, including the presence of an interfering third person. Today is a day when you are urged to step back and reflect on your relationship. Willpower will be crucial to overcome challenges, but it is also essential to be aware of real harmony in the relationship. Tensions may arise due to resistance to change, and unexpected events could reveal uncomfortable truths. The key is to face reality and make decisions that promote your emotional well-being. Consider whether the current relationship is based on solid aspects or external circumstances. Introspection and conscious decision-making are essential at this time. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. Let go of the imposter syndrome, Aquarius. Thanks to Mercury retrograde in Capricorn, you may have doubted your professional skills and capabilities over the last few weeks. However, you can begin to release the self-doubt starting today when Mercury retrograde leaves Capricorn for Sagittarius. The rest of this retrograde will be primarily focused on networking, social media, and dreams. So, you may have to keep an eye on any drama in your work community and to watch what you are posting onto your professional platforms to avoid any potential blunders. This lunar energy is bringing a few financial issues to the surface and you are encouraged to concentrate on matters of work and health. Have money troubles been having a negative impact on your health? If so, it is time to face them and find ways to deal with them in a healthy manner? Spending some time among nature can be especially therapeutic for you, so you are encouraged to do this as well as meditate throughout the day as this brings you a sense of inner peace and enables you to see things with greater clarity. The tarot gives you your lucky number. Your lucky numbers for December 27 are 39, 15, 24, 17, 50, 22. Daily Love Suddenly, as of today, you may notice that the present Mercury retrograde phase is taking on a different spin than it had previously, Aquarius. Now, with our cosmic messenger, our planet of the mind and communication, spinning in your solar 11th house of friendships, communities, and online dating, you may be hearing from old flames, exes, or people that you lost touch with. If you'd like to reconnect with someone, this is an auspicious period to do so. Don't be afraid to reach out as long as you're not just feeding drama. What is the nature of the dialogue between you and your romantic partners? Do you know how to communicate clearly and directly with one another in a way that enables there to be trust and transparency in your relationship? The moon is in Taurus and in your fourth house today. This placement is urging you to contemplate on these questions. One of the major foundations of a healthy, successful and fulfilling partnership is one that is built on open, honest and clear communication. This is a great time for you to practice learning how to be in open dialogue with your partner. What are the ways in which you can strengthen that aspect of your relationship? If there is something you've been wanting to share or express, this would be a good time to do so, in a loving and diplomatic way of course. 
at work. It does not matter how many hurdles are now placed in the path of your career. You will be able to sail through them as if they did not exist. Success seems to come effortlessly to you now, but it is vital to avoid a feeling of overconfidence. You need to realize that luck has as much a role in your success as your ability and this may not always be in your favor. How good are you at expressing your ideas to others? Do you feel skillful in your communication abilities at work? The moon is in Taurus and in your fourth house and these are all questions to meditate on. Communication can truly be everything sometimes. What good are all your brilliant ideas if you don't have the ability to clearly explain and bring them across to your audience? Today would be a good day to advertise yourself and the services you offer. Health. You are in the pink of health. But you have to be cautious of the changing weather. You seem to be affected by sinus or a similar disease which is right now an acute stage but can get severe or become chronic if you tend to be careless. Find means to stay in a warm environment, which is free of dust as well. Your natural curiosity and thirst for knowledge are heightened during this transit, Aquarius. You may find yourself drawn to new and exciting experiences, so make sure to explore your options. This is also a great time to try new hobbies or take up a new course of study. Your communication skills are also enhanced, so it's a good time to network and make new connections. For activities, consider taking a road trip or trying out a new restaurant. Moonstone and amethyst crystals will enhance your intuition and help you stay calm, and a diet that includes brain-boosting foods like blueberries and almonds will support your mental acuity. Family and Friends It is time to take a step back and examine your relationship in the cold light of reason. You have been ignoring some information about your partner but you need to realize that this will not make it go away. Instead, you need to factor that in as you analyze the dynamics of your relationship. You may have to take some tough decisions at this time. There's a lot going on in the sky today, Aquarius, but unfortunately sex isn't exactly written in the stars. To begin with, the primal sun is moving out of Sagittarius and slipping into Capricorn and your hidden 12th house of the subconscious. In one month the sun will move on to your sign and fill you with all its cosmic gifts, but for now it's time for you to power down and get some rest before birthday season kicks in. Couple this with the fact that Mercury currently retrograde, and, well, like I said today isn't exactly about love. For the next few weeks focus on streamlining yourself into a stronger, healthier version of yourself who will impress others but more importantly impress yourself. That way, when the planets come calling, you'll be ready to perform. Compatibility. At work Virgo. In love Scorpion. In luck Libra. Your lucky color today. Amethyst. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.